Hello and welcome to my video. In today's video we're going to talk about a little bit more of my second race of Le Mans Ultimate in LMP2 cars. The first race I ever had in LMP2 in Le Mans Ultimate. It was a pure blast, it was fun. There were some incidents here and there, but I had a full joy racing in Le Mans Ultimate. As you can see right behind here, that is exactly that you're gonna see now on the video. Now let's check it out. Alright guys, here we are in Lemon Ultimate. Today we're gonna talk about a little bit of my race in Monza for the second race I ever did in Lemon Ultimate. That's it's basically one of the best races I had. Of course, there were some incidents here and there, that was the terrible thing. So let's head on to the outside of the car and see what's going to happen at the start. Oh, here we go. Bunch of cars is assembling up and they have a collision, all of them. <laughs> oh my god. But we got through it. And they're still colliding and crashing. Some had a little bit of a slow down on the outside. Oh, that was a close call. And then we have uh, something happening around here. He's coming, diving into the inside, and he is colliding and he's spinning around. And that was the terrible idea. Trying to die bump on that bus stop. That's something you're not supposed to do around that corner. Oh, that was a terrible join. Or not terrible joint, but that was a terrible die bomb. Here we are, driving side by side with the other driver, we got a better exit on the outside. Surprisingly, we did. And here we go. Our first lap around this sh chicane S turn, or whatever you call it. I don't know the, all the names of the terms. Sorry about that, guys. But anyway. This guy was a waving a little bit, but here we go. Going side in, side by side, and I'm going a little bit too slow around here, and he bumped on my rear, and that was not ideal. Oh my goodness, we have to watch that on the replay. Oh. Well, 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 welcome back guys, we are back on the race and here we are in the second time on that bus stop and we have finally got it cleanly around this time. And look at this, we are driving hard, getting around, but look at the mirror. Look at the driver getting a die bomb on the inside. He goes wide on the exit, but he got so better way out still. And there is one that was spinning out. I think he got too much on the curb. Now we are following the car up ahead of us, and that was not what I wanted. I'm blocking the brakes, getting some vibration on the uh, wheel. That's not very funny to have during the race. So we're losing a little bit of time because of that, that I think. But anyway, we're having fun, we are racing, we are racing. That is the best thing we can do, is just to race and have fun. That was I find my match in the Le Mans Ultimate. 
is it's just pure fun it's very enjoyable the driver behind me he really wants to get past me there he's trying to get through on the slipstream there is he close enough to make a move it seems like he's not he is staying behind still and I'm locking a little bit of the brakes so you can see the smoke coming out of the tire and we are still on the run. Amazingly, we haven't got too much damage on our car after some incidents we had earlier being crashed on the rear and side bump at all. I can clearly see smokes coming out of my tires when racing around. Oh boy. <clears throat> oh, we are getting a little bit loose around here. Sorry for being a little bit silent there. We were a little bit focused on buttons to finding which button we were trying to click on to change camera angles for you guys. Oh, somebody has went off. Somebody has gone off here. And he disappeared. There he is. There he is. Side on the road with no rear wing. Look how he's driving. It was looking like he was trying to block. Don't know what that was about, but it could be a heavy damage on the car without no rear wing. It kind of looked like that. Uh, look at the drive behind, he's trying to use the flash to distract me. You see he's trying and I'm staying on my racing line. I'm staying on my apex and he have lost it a little bit again. He is flashing with the lights, hoping that will be a distraction. To be fair, in Le Mans Ultimate, the mirror is way too up for me to be distracted with, and the lights in the uh, pure daylight is not helping too much, to be fair. Oh, uh, look at the brakes in the front of my car. You see how red they are in the front? God, that is uh, so hot in there. You see their bright yellow-orange around the uh, brake pads there. Look at that. It seems like my brake pass is way hotter than any other uh, out there. Holy moly. I, I, I'm just gonna say guys, I know just here to comment a little bit on uh, Le Mans Ultimate uh, of my driving and all, but I just have to say to you, to you guys, Le Mans Ultimate has done everything that I would love to race in. We all went three wide, <laughs> not three wide, but we all went off there, following one another, but here he is, again, he got another chance to get past me around this right here he got a better exit but that was so good passing we're side by side here but i'm breaking a little bit earlier just to not going too wide around here because we have seen how what can possibly happen around that corner ergo we have seen that in formula one in some other racing games with the exact same thing that happened between in Formula 1 in realism between Lewis Hamilton and uh, Max Verstappen and he goes off-road and sliding missing his braking line so hard so we are side by side again but I'm not like oh uh, no I'm not gonna be stupid let's be f honest there I'm just giving up there just gave him that position I just let him have it So, that was me trying to be nice. Honestly, I might be too nice when I'm racing, but that's how it is. And I was locking so hard on the brakes here, 
and that was not the best I could do. But whatever can we say, it's racing. God, it is fun. But as I was trying to say, I might be way too nice all around when I try to race in overall in online racing. I've been in too much accidents. That has been my fault, and some of them have probably not been in my fault. So I have been lo lost a little bit, a lot of confidence when it comes to racing online. In that case, so racing in Le Mans Ultimate is gaining that confidence a little bit better because you can r race side by side without the net code, like iRacing does. You're being not hard punished for netcodes. And you don't have that people screaming at you immediately or distracting you during a race with microphone. You can turn it off if you want to in iRacing and so on. I think you can do that here as well in Lemon Ultimate. I don't know. I haven't tested that. But I like those uh, voice microphones off during the race. But anyway, I find it very distractive and um, not so good because people can use so much words and discourage you as a driver if a netcode or some accident might happen between you and the other guy. And it's that's not kind of good the thing that you might have in a race. Yeah, it can be funny to listen to them uh, at times, but it's so distracting. I find it distracting, at least for me. But I don't know for you guys, but at least for me it is very distractive. It's not fun-ish. So yeah. But if you're going to be talking more about Le Mans Ultimate here, this is very low graphics. It's medium graphics. Everything is set to low. Just be honest. How do you think the quality like is looking like in Le Mans Ultimate on low graphics? This is low graphics. It probably will look very nice on high graphics and very, very high graphics. But on low graphics and medium uh, sets for the quality in general, I think it's very nice. I have nothing to complain about it. Just think about the details. You can see around Le Mans Ultimate. Sure, it can be more pixelated and stuff like that, but come on. I think it's really good. At least, I think it is good. Oh, I'm very good at locking the brakes. <laughs> I haven't been uh, figuring it out because it's my first time ever racing in Le Mans Ultimate. I have raced in uh, R Factor 2 before in some time. I actually loved it there. The only thing I found a little bit lacking in uh, R Factor 2, they, was, they were picking a lot of tracks for rookies. That is very unknown of tracks. That wasn't so very good to race on, in my opinion. But in general, the R Factor 2 is really. Oh, he's going off! He's going off! Oh, no, 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 no! What the hell happened there? He just lost the brakes and just spun. My, my, my. That has to be the worst ever you had to go through. Oh boy, what do you know? Oh boy. Yep, I can do some Mikey Mouse noise. I don't know if that was Mikey Mouse noise. I was just trying. But anyway. Uh, just think about R Factor 2 and Le Mans Ultimate. They are looking pretty much alike, but 
in Lemon Ultimate, it looks a little bit better graphically than um, R Factor 2. Kinda, I think. I don't know. But it kinda feels a lot better ish than the R Factor 2. But I hope uh, Lemon Ultimate will get uh, Notch Life uh, and some other tracks. Hopefully. Because I do love racing around North Life. Huh? If I am not wrong, this might be turning into the one last lap. Now, it's probably one lap more and the lap will be ended, I think, if I'm not remembering wrong. Because it's a 16 minute race. And probably it's uh, two more laps. It might be. I don't know. I don't remember. What do you know? <laughs> but yeah, not much did happen during the end of the race anyway. Except from the, that car was spinning. We're getting close to the driver ahead of us though, because we kind of try, we are figuring it out driving the LMP2 in uh, Lamar Ultimate. But I have found very enjoyable to drive LMP2s in iRacing. And I hope that I would enjoy it in Lamar Ultimate, and I really do. Once you get that tires heated up in Lamar Ultimate, it's just. Mwah, it's amazing. But I hope I will figure out the uh, hypercar as well, somehow, because they are way faster. You have to click some buttons here and there to activate um, uh, the uh, hybrid, I think. But yeah, I do love this. I think this is the best, one of the best racing games I have raced. For a very long time, I put got a smile on me on road racing games. That is. All right, this might be the last lap. Oh, look at that staring around! Jesus, I didn't even remember I was staring that much. Probably I did. <laughs> You have like the in sound in uh, in uh, Le Mans Ultimate. You have, I think you the, the sounds that we hear coming under the car. I think that it's probably some uh, um, rubber or some uh, gravel or some rocks that hits under your car somewhere on the track randomly. Like that. It is just nice detail. Man, I, I am just loving this. It's just fun. I'm sorry I'm not talking much. Uh, I'm just thinking. Because I have not, not anything scripted to what to say. Everything I'm saying is just pure out of the mind of my head that is just coming out it's just talking randomly that's that's basically what I do talking randomly yep that was the end of the race so anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope I'll see you on the next one take care guys see you in the next one